皆もご存知渦巻きナルトIt's your boy RJ in other building, and today we are talking. This, this, this is me more gameplay guides and stuff, as you would have seen by the title. I am opening back up Wolves of the Spell Academy, or should I say, we being me, Poison, and E. Um, I don't know if my, a lot of you might have come from Poison's channel because he did a video announcing that I'll be doing a video as well. Um, but yeah, we'll be opening our Wolves of the Spell next generation. So I don't know if you don't knew that but I had a Wolves of the me, Ian Poison hosted a Wolves of Despair Academy a few years ago and it went really well. We a lot of players that you may know today, so for example Cold Revenge, aka Cold Hearted, uh MK Aegis as well, Anti Nay, Ace, Anime, um and a lot of players um kind of a lot of players that are now good have come from Wolves of Despair Academy. So um you know, so we thought, so I figured that, you know, maybe I should do a 2.0, there's a lot of people I'm teaching now, with NA and EU, and I was like, I can do a 2.0 maybe, and do a Wars of Despair Academy for that too, so if you are interested in that, then I would, you know, kind of explain the expectation and stuff going from now, as I will be doing stuff a little bit different compared to the last time, um, due to obviously trial, trial and error, you know, some things go wrong, you gotta do it better this time, so that is what this video will be. If you want to talk to me further about the expectations and commitments, um, then please let me know. Obviously, I will be putting in other teachers as well as myself, but I'll be the main person teaching the students as it is. So, what are the commitments? So, there are some commitments to the academy. This academy, before I did the academy, so anybody who wanted to join could join, but this time round, due to the fact that um, I'm very busy, and I don't really want to teach people who generally I feel like we're just going to come and go. It's going to be a bit more, it's going to be a little bit harder to get into this academy. Not saying that it's picky and choosy, but for me, it's mainly down to if you're committed. If you're committed, then you have no problem getting in. Um, and just because you are in doesn't mean you're staying. So um, these are the commitments for the academy as well. So firstly, um, you will be expected to train a minimum of twice a week if you want to do more you can but a minimum of twice a week and in some cases once a week if you're training once a week then you're expected to kind of practice all the stuff that we got over in that lesson uh in your own time but if you're training twice a week then you'll be expected to still practice those things out but more so we'll be going stuff in through the lesson as well so ideally twice but in some cases obviously we know people have lives and that's your priority once a week um i feel like is more than more than able seven days twice and twice a week it, even if it's just like half an hour to an hour long like nothing wrong with that um, we will have a leaderboard system in there as well, which you will have to challenge once a week. So obviously, I'm not going to go too deep into the how that works now, but basically, um, there will be a leaderboard uh, system where, in order to move up, you have to challenge the person above you to a first to five. Um, and if you lose to the person below you, then obviously you will go down. So you are expected to also challenge that leaderboard once a week as well. And just in general, actively playing. Obviously, we don't expect you to play every single day. Uh, again. <laughs> even I don't play every single day just because you know we have lives and stuff there's of, and commitments outside of the game but um, you will be expected to actively play and train whether it's with the people in the academy or just generally playing ranks and stuff just because you need to be able to gain experience um, you know lessons are one thing but you gotta gain experience through playing and you know that's, that's what you would need to do as well um, obviously like I said that's the main commitments of the Wolves of Spirit Academy uh, again, for further notice, obviously anyone who went into join will, will speak to me first before being added to it. But you will have access to me, E and Poison. It will be mostly me e, uh, rather than E and Poison. They will be handling other stuff within Walls of Despair. But um, it will mainly be me there and all the people from the generation before. So not all of them, some of them will be there helping me out. As well as if there are any teachers. Um, let's say there are people watching this and you don't necessarily want to be a student, you want to be a teacher. If you are interested in being a teacher for Wolves of the Spare Academy, then again, hit me up. We can have a conversation about my expectations regarding being a teacher for the Academy. 
Um, so yeah, in terms of the result, so like what um, we'll be doing, we'll be doing tournaments for the academy where you can win money as well. So whether it be fifty pounds, fifty pounds, a hundred pounds, or fifty dollars, a hundred dollars, whether you're EU or NA, because um, I'll be teaching both sides. I won't be mixing them, but there'll be a separate chats for both of them. So we'll be doing tournaments for the students as well. So that'll be exclusively for the students where you can win money if you want. So you can win your fifty pounds, your hundred pounds, or fifty dollars, a hundred dollars, whatever the prize pool may be, as well. Obviously, we'll be doing 2v2s, 3v3s, 4v4s. If there's a lot of students, so we can obviously do more regarding competitive them. We'll be making like, you know, squads within the academy as well for you to train with, having mentors, um, high level players that are willing to mentor or even just, you know, play with them or spend time with them as well. And we'll be doing that. Basically, we're trying to give a lot of players a lot of opportunities to become at a high level. And the reason why I do this is because I feel like one of the reasons with Storm is that we're not getting many people reaching a high level of gameplay. So I feel like um, due to the fact that I've made a lot of players already really, really strong as it is, um, Grush James being another one for puppets, um, that, you know, like this is something that I feel like I can do to help you guys. So if you are interested, please hit me up on please beat me up on my Discord and the links in the link in the description below. If you do want to join this academy, you're going to have to join my Discord as well as you're going to have to be a subscriber of this channel. So without further ado, um I think without further ado I can end in the video. I mean I kind of am ending the video. <laughs> but um yeah so if you want further information about Wolves of Despair Academy then yeah hit me up on my place to PSN RGX Campbell but definitely you're going to have to join my Discord, which will be in the link in the description down below. So without further ado, I bid you guys farewell. I hope you guys enjoy. Uh, I hope to see you guys in, within the academy, should I say. So yeah, peace.